Now, before the video starts, make sure you hit the like button and the subscribe button because apparently 70% of y'all ain't even subscribed and that's childish. Hey guys, it's Wilson, also known as Designed by Will, and in today's video we'll be designing some pieces for a streetwear brand called Northern Walls. Now this brand name was picked by my IG followers, and I've been watching like 6 hours of Game of Thrones, so yeah, that's where their name inspired from, alongside the other option, which was Castle Republic, which personally was my favourite, but apparently you guys don't like that. For this video, I actually got some art direction, whatever that means. For this project, the message is inspired by war propaganda and the 80s peace movement. As for the art itself, I took inspiration from Cactus Plant Flea Market, which is a pretty dope streetwear brand, and also one of my favorite artists, Blue Boy. Without further ado, let's get started. Firstly, I decided to go search for an icon or a symbol for our brand, for example, like Nike with their tick. Now, I don't know why this took me so long, but I had so much ideas for this one part of the project, like a compass. But down the line, I ended up just using this graphic for a t-shirt at the back, the main graphic, rather than a symbol of the brand. I thought it would look better as a larger piece rather than small little symbol because of the amount of detail I wanted to display in it with all the lines between the finger cracks and everything. After finishing up in Photoshop, I just took the drawing into Illustrator and used the image trace tool to turn it into a vector. Um, that's way easier than just filling it in Photoshop using the horrible bucket tool that doesn't even fill properly or even worse the paintbrush because that would take way too long. I ended up just using a normal typeface with the Arabic letters typed out as wars, mainly because Japanese characters are kind of overplayed at the moment by everyone, and it matched my initial art direction. For the word northern, I used bold and squared out font just to symbolize the wall and its integrity. I wanted to make the logo simple and put it in a rectangle. Thinking back, I should have put it in a rectangle like the Supreme logo. Now that I have my two main pieces for this project, the rest was just finding things that match my art direction and fit my message. I had to look at everything from swords to flowers, but all in, I just used one of my ideas I did for the Trinity to label with the flowers, but with a small twist to fit the initial war propaganda, 80s, peace movement type theme.
Now that we got our first design, it's time to move on to our second design of the project. For this one, I wanted it to stand out but not be too much, so I used the massive tie face to exaggerate the name Northern Wars with some hand drawn items to play back on that piece movement, which is part of the art direction. So the first thing I did was just go on font meme, the best place on earth, and I found a font that I liked. Like I said, the like I said in the last video, once I have my font, the rest is just easy to me. The words, art is war, were inspired by Blue Boy. He's an amazing designer slash artist who really does anything he wants. And that's what I strive to be, a creative without boundaries. I do my design collections in three and I couldn't break it now, but all in, I love how everything turned out. It's simple yet effective with the messaging of war while having a playful aspect of the hand drawn items to reflect the 80s peace movement. Now let's just get straight into the final designs. Design first, which was the skeleton hand with the flowers mounting. The main message behind that one was beauty within the madness. I love that quote. I've been using that quote for ages now. It's one of my favorite. And it's basically just symbolizing that whether you're in war or anything, there's always a beauty to that aspect. Whether it's the glory after the war or even whatever you're fighting for, there's always a beauty within the madness. And that's what inspired this whole skeleton hand with the flowers melting into the skeleton hand it's just blending it in causing unity and yeah the second design northern war with the flower projects and the gun it's also the same aspect beauty within the madness but i wanted this one to be like one of those stussy shirts like stussy global something like that that's that's mainly what inspired me and also the cactus plant flea market how they have those bold letters placed everywhere with random stuff here and there that's what inspired the flowers also, and the art is war, overly sick claim from Blue Boy. That's his whole slogan, art is war. And yeah, um, the vector items were just from this free vector website that I found. Uh, I'll try to link it in the description if I can find it. But all in all, I think that one's my favorite, the one with the gun, because it just looks really visually pleasing. And it's very simple, but yet effective. Lastly, we just have a face front design with some typeface that says, I went to war to teach nothing but war. It's just initially playing on like the government, stuff like that, how they say they go to war to fix problems, this and that. But initially they just go to war to teach people how to go into war. And it says, go to the north, pointing upwards, which is the branding. Also with some like kids child's play and some bright colors such as purple, blue, um, red and yellow which plays back on that peace movement of the 80s playful playful peace movement But yeah, actually that one might be my second favorite design even though it's very simple and it's very easy to do I really like how it turned out and if this was in production I'd probably buy that one rather than the rest of them because it looks the nicest to me I don't know. It's the simple things that get to you that are more effective Thank you for checking out this video guys. I appreciate your support, especially in the last few videos. You guys have been blowing it up. 
Um, and I don't know whether that's the YouTube gods pushing me through the algorithm or you guys just sharing my work. I appreciate everything you guys do. And don't forget to hit the link in the description to check out my website. I have a bunch of free assets that you guys can buy. Also some paid premium assets that are very effective, such as the Oasis Star Pack, which is pretty key for making designs, I guess, in Illustrator if you don't know your way around there. But yeah, that's it. And make sure you follow me on Instagram at Design by Will. And don't forget to comment which one was your favorite and what you want, what you guys want to see in the next video. See you guys later. Peace.